Right then, so this is my Moorman mini tripod. Um, as soon as you hold it, you can tell that it's uh, it's good quality. It's solid, made out of aluminium. There's weight to it, but I think more than anything, when you open and close the legs, there's um, there's friction to that movement, so you can have them set at whatever angle you want. Uh, like that one further down just to show you uh, a couple of things before I do that if you turn it to that way that's the furthest you, that you can have the legs yeah and it won't go down any further than that if you turn it a little bit more you can actually have it so that it's almost flat and very stable on the ground uh, a couple of things that you need to know soft rubber feet that when it's down stop it from sliding anyway even when you're putting weight on it and most importantly so on the top there you've got a 3 8 threaded screw when you go like that I'll show you from the side so there's a 3 8 threaded screw if it comes into focus focus try over this side there we go no. right there we go Right, so a 3 8 threaded screw, yet when I press down without breaking the nails, it then goes to a 1 quarter threaded screw. So no fiddling around, uh, no having to carry any adapters or anything. So that'll take my, uh, my, ball, um, my ball mount easily, um, but primarily, so obviously that just screws when you press it down right handed right when you press it down onto the the 3 8 thread goes back and you're left with as you can see the 1 quarter thread that's gone into the camera nice and easily right However, that's not necessarily the reason why I've got this. The primary reason for getting this tripod is because, pop that there for a second. I got this gimbal, which is fantastic to use. However, when I got it, it got supplied with a, an awfully small little tripod that was neither used to anybody. So this, Pop it on like so, and now when I want to carry, change that. Right now, I want to use the gimbal. I can stand it down without any problem. As you can see, nice and easy. Plop down. If I want to pick it up and carry it around simply a case of doing that so there's the gimbal there's the tripod and that's the gimbal on the tripod like so so for those reasons I think that this is a good buy um, what you can also do not with the gimbal on but with a camera attached you get some straps so what I'll do is I'll just set this up and show you bit like this uh, that you can use basically in any configuration on each leg there's two um, two slats which you can go through so you've got one for each leg um, I, I, I've taken the camera off because basically for this to be of any use you need to have um, a ball mount or something like that either on the end there or, or one of these legs just so that you can adjust the angle of the camera. Uh, if I put the camera on it as it is, then it'd just be pointed in a, a silly angle, which is neither use nor ornament. I'd show it with the ball mount on, but it's currently attached to another tripod and I can't be bothered taking it off. But when all said and done, it's a quality bit of tackle this, like I said, nice soft uh, feet, plenty of, um, of movement in it, but, but a restricted type of movement. You, you have to play with it to, to understand what I'm talking about. Uh, the legs can be locked flat or, or otherwise and uh, for the gimbal, absolutely fantastic.